Welcome guys on how to install mods in Minecraft. Okay, first you gotta go to the favorite web browser, mine being Firefox. Ignore that. And ignore that. Oops. Okay, let's open it again. Okay, now on Google or Yahoo, I don't know which provider you use, you're gonna look for Minecraft Forge. And you want to click on the very first link. You're, gonna, you're going to scroll down and go to download recommended. Uh, since I'm using a Windows operating system, I will go usually for the Windows. But if you're using Mac, the installer should be good enough already. So. Actually, let's say I'm, I'm in a Mac. I'm just go to for installer, and there should be just gonna wait a few seconds here. Click on skip, and there you go, save. Okay, now on this little arrow over here, if you are using Firefox, you're gonna click on it and click on this folder, and it will take you to where the file was downloaded. I don't know in other browsers how it works, but it's the same feature. Okay, so once we have this, you want to double click on it. And just, we're going to wait for it to pop up. Oh, there it is. Now, the Mercurius thingy is just something that will take information of your system to make should Forge works for the future. I don't know. I usually check it off. It's not necessary. Make sure install client is checked. This is important. Uh, the path should be the one, the one to Minecraft. This one is set automatically, so there's nothing to change. Just click OK. Just wait. And there you go. OK. We can close this. I'm going to minimize that and let's go to Minecraft. The launcher starts. And don't press play yet. We're going to play on this arrow next to it and select Forge. Okay, once it's selected, you can go and play. Make sure it says Forge here to play. Now, the menu will be different. You will see in a moment. Okay, there you go. So this is a loading screen. It's gonna just load everything that it needs to. So we're just gonna wait for it. Okay, there you go. So this is a menu. Actually, to make it look like you guys, I'm gonna disable my resource pack for now. There you go. So yeah, default Minecraft. You should have a new button named Mods. That means that it worked. Uh, you will have these mods, which are pretty much the basic structure of to load any other mods that is necessary so we're going to ignore that we don't have any custom mods so we're going to go done quit the game okay going back to firefox i'm gonna go for let's say minecraft mods enter minecraftmods.com oh okay and which one i was looking for this one overlord i'm gonna click on overlord and scroll down you can scroll 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 on download no actually no ignore that go to forum mm -hmm. okay okay i'm looking for the 1.11.2 version that's the version that at least at the date of this video is the last is. So I'm gonna click on it. Okay, I'm gonna wait. There you go. Save file. And let's go to where it downloaded. There it is. Overlord. So I'm gonna right click on it and press I mm, you can do you can do copy. I actually like to do cut. It's the same function actually. So I'm gonna click cut. Then on your address bar here, you wanna click on it and type percent app data percent when i enter 
it will take you to this um, folder you want to go here to Minecraft it should be on the top of the list if sorted by name Minecraft and go to your mods folder if you don't have one just create a new one and call it mods like this simple and you go inside of it right click and you're gonna put the file there and that's pretty much it you can close this close Firefox and open Minecraft again Forge is selected play hi Nvidia alright there you go just wait for it to load right now if we go to mods we're going to see it right here overlord that means that the mod it, it was installed correctly so we go to done let's try it out single player overworld this is a world I created let's play it loading building <laughs> blah 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 oh, okay got it. hi so let's get rid of all this crap all right, so let me go. I need an open space. No. Aha. Okay, so this mod allows you to command an army of skeletons. So we're going, I'm going to go to my inventory and you will see here a new option. That means there are more op, more of this to look for. So I'm going to click on this arrow over here. And there you go, Overlord. This will show the new things that come from the mod. So this, I don't know, Skeleton Water Maker, I'm going to select that, put it here. Let's check it out. There you go. Okay, so this is where you can create the skeleton. So you add your bones there. Okay, then we need milk, which we can get on the Overlord tab. There you go, milk bottle. So let's add that to it. There you go, milk. I guess we need armor. So I'm gonna go back here, take diamonds, armor, diamond sword. Okay, got that armor helmet boots uh-huh the sword mm, i'm missing something this ring okay where is it go here and then the ring overlord seal right click to make this your seal mm. i'm gonna take this the skin suit put it here and huh, I'm missing something. I don't know what I'm I don't know what I'm missing. That doesn't do anything. Hmm. Well I can just use the X, so and I can right click on it and make it follower, wonder, station. He's dying, of course, because... Hmm. Alright, guys, that will be it. That's how you install mods. I'm trying to figure out this crap. And thank you so much.